there are a number of hidden keys on the iPad's keyboard that you may not know about, um, particularly for foreign languages. So if you were to hold down the A key, you get a whole lot of alternatives, so particularly for different languages. If you want to type an A with a, an accent, just slide your finger and pick the one you want. So keys that have hidden accents on the letters, if you like, uh, all the vowels, the E, there's some different letters over the uh, E, I, O, U, if I can find it, U, S, L, C, and Z. So if you want to type any of those different characters, hold your finger on the, the letter and just slide it up to change the character. The other two that have hidden characters are the apostrophe and the quotes, double quote marks. If I wanted to type this, the dog, and then I need an apostrophe there, I can tap the alternative keyboard and find it here. Then I can go back and type the S, the dog's paws. There is a, a quicker way though. The apostrophe, if you hold down the apostrophe or the exclamation mark key, you'll see the apostrophe, so you can just slide your finger up and use it there. But far quicker is to flick your finger up. With a quick flick, the apostrophe goes in. It's quicker than doing holding your finger down and selecting it. Just type the word flick up the key. I'm going to do it quickly though. And there you have your apostrophe. Now the other one is over the question mark, if you hold the question mark down, uh, is the quotes. So I can do, I uh, slide my finger up and, and do it that way, hold them down. Again, flick the finger over that key, flick it up, and it's, you hardly seem to have to stop t uh, typing in that way. But they're all the hidden keys on the keyboard.